Hey guys, what's going on? D-Mac here. Uh, ho hopefully you like my intro there. Thought I'd try something a bit different. But here's my V8370Z. Oops, already here. <laughs> but here is my new Nissan 370Z. It looks a lot better than it did and it sounds so much better as you just... As you guys heard for the first time, as I just heard for the first time. Oh, that sounds so mint. Um, but here we are. Circuit race. Race 1. Look at it. It's actually such a nice colour. It took me literally three seconds to decide the colour. Like, I know what colour needs to go on this car. Alright, let's smash this out. Let's go. Let's gotta get to dodge. Ah, uh, this is still on the hard difficulty as well. Or whatever it is. The above average. I should have drifted into that. That's what these cars are built for. As Tokyo Drift has clearly shown us that the 370 is totally a drift car. It was rear-wheel drive before I converted it. You know what the best thing about this game is? Is that you can drive whatever car specs that you want. So you can have such a high-powered car in any event and they adjust the cars that are racing to you. So you having to adjust the cars to them, which is what every racing car game should do. Because apart from simulation ones, uh, apart from that, like Grant, you got your Grand Theft, Grand Theft Auto is apparently now a simulation racing game. Uh, Gran Turismo, uh, your Forza, um, your your the actual racing sim series, not the Horizon, um, or the Horizon, the the Forza Motorsport. Um, this actually sticks to the road really well. It just doesn't like turning. Or well, at least probably 200 k's into a corner doesn't help. But um, yeah, you play. You got your Gran Turismo. You got your Forza. We actually started on Gran Turismo. I actually loved Gran Turismo. Gran Turismo 4. And then I don't know something about Gran Turismo 5 ruined it for me. And I think it was just because Forza 4 had such better sounds to their cars. And it was definitely different on my... It just sounds so much better. And I think that's what makes Forza a better series than um, Gran Turismo. Wow. <gasps> oh, I wasn't paying attention. But yeah, that's what I think makes it a better series. But now that Project Cars is coming out. Now, I heard this off Gossip Lamb a little while ago that Project Cars was coming out. Oh, I can't remember the release date. I think it's next year. I'm not, don't know. If you guys are actually watch, looking um, for actually for a release date, I've got no idea. But um, I, was, I think they said it was next year. So, he goes, are you getting it? And I'm like, I don't even know anything about it. I haven't looked it up, but I probably won't be because I just thought it was going to be another simulation racing game like Forza Horizon. Oh, not uh, simulation, like another arcade game, like um, Horizon and Need for Speed and all that. Because uh, yeah, well, I just thought that'd be it'd be like that. And then I found it yesterday. And it's beta, and it looks amazing. Like it is seriously the best racing game that I've seen. And by the looks of it, it well done. 
the feel of it would be amazing too because they t they take people from iRacing and all like the big simulation games where people actually compete in it and compete for money are going this is going to be a really good game and I f find that it's like exciting to know that like there's going to be a game that's like Horizon and that burn out from wind Oh, I'm not going to do that race about. I'm going to try and beat this guy first. And then I'll do it. What's he driving in there? BMW. It's close. It's got turbo, though. Head out now. <laughs> that guy's ruining me. That's how you get in front of them. But yeah, like the Project Cars is... Just, I, I cannot wait for it. It is literally nearly every track in the world. Or at least all the good ones. <laughs> Has Bathurst. I'm happy. <laughs> the amount of times I've driven on Bathurst and the... You know what? That was the main reason I actually got it. Xbox. And the, it's the main reason I kept my Xbox. Sorry. Is because Forza 5 promised Bathurst again. And I was like, no, you, you, you got me. But then Gran Turismo announced it a couple of weeks later that they were also having it. I was like, no, too late. Forza's has already got me sold. So. Turn left. If this car was real drive, this challenge would have been a lot harder. But there we go. Pay attention to the difficulty Pay attention. rating of festival racers before you, you challenge them. Um, Higher difficulty ratings mean bigger payouts. Thanks, I just won 70 grand pretty much. Okay, where's the world map? Oh, wow. Well, um, I don't even know where I was out there. I'll just fast travel to it. Only because I just won 65 grand, bro. Alright, let's get this race underway. Oh, I thought my Xbox just froze then. Like. Uh, there we go. Nice. Oh, it's an awesome car. I'm actually loving the color of it. St. Martin Sports Cars. Sprint Race. Oh, yes. I like Sprint Races a lot more. This BMW doing a burnout. Why is everyone doing burnouts these days? Noobs with their rear wheel drives. Bang. All drive here, look at that. Jeez, look at that takeoff. Yeah. Well, I just crashed into a fence after bragging about my takeoff. It just grips so much, though. It's probably the AI know what they're doing because of the lines on the other side of the road. I do not trust this corner coming up. Knowing this car, it's going to crash. Pushing it as much as they're, they're pushing their cars. So I don't stuff around. Okay, I'm going straight through this. <gasps> I was really going to pay, start paying attention. Oh, great. There's another wall there. <laughs> How far are we? 50 cents, sweet. This second place is right on my tail, though. What the hell was that car? I don't know, it helped me break, though. It was a nice little jump. It, I've got to work on this uh, car's turning ability. Look at this. It, does not, it doesn't break. It doesn't turn while braking. I know it's not good to break and turn at the same time, but it's an arcade game. It should be able to do that. <laughs> Alright, let's get this nice last corner out of the way and just smash it down the straight. Yep. Well, that's a win. 
See you guys. I'm going home. Nice driving, mate. Another 20 points. Sure was. Anyway, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like the video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel so you can see these pop up daily, along with my Call of Duty Advanced Warfare series. And yeah, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.